So I like y-axis parting, and I also like the idea of having a dedicated part-off tool on the other side of my Prototrack's cross slide. My Prototrack also doesn't have a y-axis, it only has an x-axis. Uh, but I was thinking there would be an interesting way to hold a y-axis part-off tool and that would achieve uh, two things for me. It would be a, a smaller use of space for the pot-off tooling, uh, allowing me to have more use of my uh, cross slide. And it would also uh, give me a Y-axis uh, pot-off tool. And I thought that would be pretty cool to use and try out. So I looked at my options uh, to achieve this and I found a short blade holder. So the only thing that I needed to do was to make the tooling that attaches to my cross slide and then holds the blade holder. So I think it's going to work out pretty well and it's going to be nice to have. Now I do like to try different things out and see how it works. So I could have bought a standard uh, Y-axis uh, blade, but I went ahead and I made a different style, one that would um, have the forces pulling on it rather than pushing. Um, but when I tried it out, it didn't work. What it wound up happening was that it stretched open the opening that held the insert and the insert fell out. So I went ahead and I made a different blade that is uh, more in line with the style that you can buy. Well, I hope that you enjoyed this video. Have a good one and take it easy.